Hey guys, this is The Card Collector, and today, by the title of this video, we are doing some boxes of 2015-16 Series 1. This stuff has skyrocketed. We're doing three, so I just want to say I hope you guys enjoyed my Friday video. I guess it happened two days ago, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was some pretty decent pulls. I love opening that box, and uh, if you haven't seen it, well, go check her out. So, let's see what we got here. Bottom, number on the box, there it is. Only problem is, some of these are extremely dented. But, I was paying, I believe, oh, I was only paying like 50 bucks a box. I remember when this stuff, blaster boxes were like 30 and nobody could give them away. It was crazy. Alright, let's see. And our big young gun is pretty rough. But there we go. We got a young gun of Garrett Sparks. All right. I guess we'll show off what we get in the box. And you get 10 packs per box, five packs per, or five cards per pack. So we're just going to set that right there. And I hope everybody subscribes, likes, shares, hits that subscribe button. So we're looking for Eichel has skyrocketed, seen it sell for over $150 a card now. The McDavid Young Gun Canvas, I haven't checked recently, but I believe it was around that $450 to $600. So, first pack was re or retail, of course. First pack is base. Oh, jersey card of Noah Hannafin. There we go. Pretty nice. So, we do get two rookies per blaster. I actually remember when... Uh, I was collecting, and they could not give away bla these blaster boxes. They're on uh, show tables, I think, for 30 bucks. First young gun pull, we got our Erratic Fasca. But I also remember when you, I could have pre-ordered a McDavid young gun. I believe they were on eBay for about $150 to $200. Uh, on Facebook, someone had them posted for $250 track shipped. But, you know, that's the way it goes. You never really, especially now, I would have never thought a McDavid was going for over $1,000 raw. But maybe in a few years, maybe McDavid's have gone up more. Maybe $2,000 a card. Who really knows? And then Jimmy Howard. I remember uh, the Summit one year. I remember, what was it, two? Uh, it was, I think, 250 for a McDavid graded nine. I was looking at it going, eh, it's only a 9. I did pick up a PSA 9, and I believe I paid like 700 bucks for it, 800 bucks for it maybe. Nicholas Patan, non-blank back, just a rookie. I remember when Patan had a lot of potential. I love going through the old stuff. It's just crazy to think, uh, like I thought Patan would uh, definitely, I would def or he would definitely pan out more than he would have been. Connor Hallebuck, Coil, and Bobby Ryan. Hmm. All right. So did we, we haven't pulled all the young guns yet. And here it is. Oh, Devin Shore. So both back-to-back -back Dallas players. Tori Krug, Scott Darling. Cool, cool. You can probably go to your shop and buy these boxes. I know they're going for now over $100. It's crazy for a blaster. I bought these. Local shop was $50. A few years ago, I could have bought hobby boxes for... I think I was paying $60 or $75 a retail or a hobby box. Because it's Series 2. Nobody wanted Series 2. It was all Series 1. So if you guys remember that, let me know down in the comments. Well, that was a pretty crappy, uh, that was a pretty crappy, uh, retail box. Yeah. All right, next box. Let's, uh, let's get this, uh, going here. Let's, uh, maybe we'll cut it differently. Maybe that will help. All right. And... We got another Garrett Sparks, and it's even worse than the first one was. And you probably think, how is this one with its dinged corners? It's dinged corners, and it's top left. Well, this one just outbeat it. 
Look at that curve. Very nice. So another Garrett Sparks. And you think it's a 50 set, uh, 50, or you get 50 young guns in the set, and we just pull back to that Garrett Sparks. Awesome. So $50 a box. Actually, I think it was like $51 um, just with tax and everything. So let's get something good here. I feel an Eichel is coming. We just don't, or I just don't know it yet. Cody Eakin, Daniel Sundin. Wow. Okay. We have Paul Martin, Frank Vetrano. Uh huh. Okay. If you guys hear wind, it's because there's a windstorm happening this weekend. So hopefully uh, it's not too bad. All right. Whoa. Goldabin. Cool. Kessler. Haven't heard of Kessler in a while. All right. Oduya, Paul Statsny, Chandler Stephenson. Interesting. Oh, PT rookie. We'll do a recap of all the major hits at the end of the video. Hoffman, Seabrook, Duclair, Sidney Crosby. Right now, probably Sidney Crosby's worth more than most of the polls. All right. Craig Smith. I feel something's coming. Matt Molson, Barkov. Okay. Next pack. We only we only have four or five left of this box. Boycock, Sharp, Linus Olmark. All right, still playing, so that's decent. And a Shane Prince. I remember everybody was high on Shane Prince. Not panned out like he is or was supposed to. Uh, let's ro rotate that a little bit. Get the glare off that. All right. Hodgson. Zadarov. Oh, Matt. Okay. We have two more chances. Then we're going on into the third box. I was, I was kind of hoping that this video would be a little bit more interesting. Oh, Tyler Johnson, Canvas. We'll do a recap of all the hits after. And a Lundquist. That they said that the surgery was successful. So it's only a matter of time before he starts playing. Chris Stewart. Oh, Holpe. Callahan, Vincent Trocek. Okay, so that was one box. Let's, uh, two boxes down. All right. This has got to be a better box, right? Right? I just cut it a bunch of times. Maybe we can, we'll get that luck going. And, uh, let's not try to, let's try to get another Garrett Sparks, another... Young gun of Garrett Sparks. And we got a young gun of this time of Jake Vertanen. There we go. It's beautiful, Jake Vertanen. Everybody kind of thought with sixth overall, he would kind of pan out a little bit better. Still not bad, but he's like the Sam Bennett of the Calgary Flames. All right. Reader, Palmonville, Perry, Ryan O'Reilly. Okay. Let's see what next we got. Pieces of wrapper flying everywhere. Check out my last video. That was Friday Night Breaks. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Jake for Tannen. Look at that. Back to back Jake for Tannens. Okay. One oversized young gun. And of course, we were looking for Eichel. Come on, Eichel. I can smell you. Where are you at? Riley Smith. Next, we've got Dion Versteeg and a uh, what is it? Cajera play for the Silver Tips. Still with the Oilers, so I kind of got excited when I seen it was an Oiler. Uh, it's always him or David Muzel. I always pull. Oh, Ryan Johansson, canvas. Bernier.
Myers, Eric Jackman, Lazar, Michael Hutchinson. I don't know, anybody remember Michael Hutchinson? Yeah, that was, uh, I, I think the last time he was with, what, Boston, Toronto, Ryan, or Dylan DeMello. Cool, cool. So four packs left to go, McDavid. Come on, where's McDavid or Eichel? Eichel I'd uh, be even happy with. Uh, his stuff's been going up. Nick Letty. Kind of disappointing. All right, let's see what we got here. Sam Bretain. There you go, from Calgary, Alberta. Cool, Panthers goalie. And Jay Bowmeister. Also from Edmonton. Grew up in Medicine Hat. All right, last pack. Let's, uh, let's open it, give it a little rub. Come on, let's get something good. Base pack. Well, that was kind of a disappointing break. But guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and we're going to do a quick recap. We got a young gun. We got a portraits. We got a canvas. We got another young gun. We got a Vertanen. We got a Chad jo or a, not a Chad Johnson, Tyler Johnson. Price. An Olmark. Frank Vertrano. Devin Shore. Erratic Fasca. And a jersey card of Noah Hannafin. So if you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and do not forget to share. That's it, guys. You will see me Tuesday with a brand new video. All right, guys. I'm out.